it's a little piece of paradise that could turn hellish. Lake Kivu, on the border of Rwanda and the Democratic Republic of Congo, contains a dangerous mix of dissolved gases. We know that Lake Kivu is a lake with problems, a lake where you find carbon dioxide in large volumes. You also find methane gas. If methane gas is extracted, it means that we're trying to stabilize the lake. A disturbance could cause a catastrophic explosion, releasing waves of suffocating CO2, threatening more than two million people close to the shore. But one $200 million privately funded project called KivuWatt is working to turn the deadly gases into energy and profit. We had to build a barge. This barge will allow the extraction of the water in the deeper layers of the lake and the removal of gas, gas processing and sending of gas to the power plant. And the power plant will produce electricity as necessary. Et la centrale électrique produira l'électricité nécessaire. Eventually, Kivu Watt hopes to almost double Rwanda's national production capacity. And right now, a government pilot project is already bringing electricity to many villages. Even though I feel that the fish harvest has declined since the arrival of the project, it is a good thing because now we have electricity in the village. With only 18% of the Rwandan population having access to electricity, connecting people to the national grid is one of the country's key priorities. People here will be hoping this natural resource will make a powerful, but not explosive, impact on their lives.